What's up, fams? It's, it's late on Monday, but I'm still trying to get this video out. So, in this uh, part of my channel, in this series, I like to talk about ride sharing, uh, what's happening here in New York City suburbs and abroad. Please feel free to like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you. All right, so let's get into it. So last week, $326.10. Very weak, weak. <laughs> um, I did make an extra $100 uh, that's not reflected here, uh, but we'll talk about that some other time. So looking at the breakdown, the only thing that uh, really impresses me here is the, uh, the promotions. Um, definitely more than I expected. I know there's been all this argument about the upfront pricing and surge, but this uh, this looks uh, pretty good. So definitely not one of my <laughs> wonderful money Mondays for sure. Still trying to be patient. Uh, I think things are still ramping up as far as individuals who are beginning to go back to work. Um, and uh, it's a work in progress. So I will say the only interesting thing on Tuesday is that um, um, I did get an, uh, an extra hundred dollars in income uh, that is not reflected in the Uber activity. I won't get into any details, but um, outside of that, regular Tuesday. Okay, so on Wednesday, um, I, I was excited about that Uber XL, that first trip. Um, of course, I did get a tip on top of that, so that's cool. Uh, as many of you know, the Excel platform was not a platform that I ran on typically prior to the pandemic. So Thursday and Friday, pretty much dud spuds for the most part. Uh, Y'all know I love my premium SUVs, so um, that was cool. Um, and that's it. So again, not the strongest week at all overall. So fams, uh, in wrapping it up, whether you ride, share, you're a millionaire, be the best person you can be, stay frosty, remember sky's the limit, peace. This logo is a registered trademark of the sky's the limit family, LLC. Bye, bubble boy. Bye, bubble boy.